Well, uh, I wrote One More Step based off of a situation that started back in 2005. I received a letter from my dad, and uh, he had written all five of his daughters. Uh, That's a lot of hairspray. Yes, he had written all five of his daughters to tell us that um, he and my mom had been to the doctor, and uh, the doctor had discovered that my dad had a terminal disease. And um, he wrote us all this letter so that in years to come, we would have something to look back on and read through and hear him telling us that he was grateful that the doctors had found this, um, this disease and grateful that he could really learn to appreciate every moment and make every moment count. So, of course, I, I get this letter and I'm just shocked and devastated. And um, I just immediately started praying for two things. Uh, I prayed that... Um, My dad would be there for my wedding day to walk me down the aisle, which um, was truly going to be a miracle because I was pretty much as single as a dollar bill. (laughs) And then I uh, also started praying that uh, when my dad's time on earth was coming to an end, that I would be able to be there um, to say goodbye to him. And um, I knew even when I was praying these two things that um, even if God didn't answer the way that I wanted him to or the way that I was hoping he would, Um, he would still be good and still be um, kind and loving and and compassionate and caring. Um, But I also knew that God says in his word that you have not because you ask not. And so I thought, I I am good at asking. (laughs) So I just asked and asked and prayed and prayed. And um, God really did perform a miracle for me. Um, In September of 2011, my dad was able to be there to walk me down the aisle to my husband, Mark. And... um, And then a couple short months later, in February of 2012, my mom called and said, I think you need to come, come now. And so um, I did, I I came straight away and um, was able to be there in the room when the doctor came in and said, this is it, this is the end. And I just sat there on the hospital bed with my dad and we just talked and I just said, dad, wow, like this is it, you're looking back at a lifetime lived, like what wisdom and what insight do you have for me out of all of your um, experience and no pressure. <laughs> and, uh, and I'll never forget what my dad said. He said, you know, everybody knows that they're dying, but nobody thinks they're dying. And it just reminded me so much of Psalm 90, 12, which says, teach us to number our days that we may gain a heart of wisdom. And if I learned anything through um, seeing my dad finish his race well here on earth, I learned that Jesus is present through the storm and he is what we need through the storm. And I learned that um, God really does answer prayer. He really, really does. And I also learned that I, I too want to make the most of my time here on earth and, and make every moment count, every second count. Um, and so I'm just so grateful that... Um, I know I'll see my dad again, and uh, I wrote this song for him. It's called One More Step.